Yeah. RB3 TV. Yeah. It going down that channel. The down way. 5150. Mm -hmm. It says Republican or Democratic. Fuck both the parties, baby. I'm black supremacists. Get the fuck out of here. I'm anti government. All right. Next question. All right. <laughs> Shit, none of the modern fucking race wars. I think I got the perfect person to answer these questions. <laughs> Kobe and LeBron. Yeah, All right. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Hmm. BB3 TV. RB3 TV. RB3 TV. <laughs> That's my ugly ass handwriting. Okay, so what that means is that you can ask me any question you want. Ooh. And I have to answer it. Let's see. Um. Okay. I have to think about what question I'm going to ask you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you sound like my, sound like my girl Beck. She from Australia. Um, I love me small sis. Yeah. <laughs> the girl's got so much ass. Oh, she's got it too. <laughs> she do? Yeah. I told you she yeah, was. You got you got to check out her interview. Check out her interview. Um, trying to think about what question I'm going to ask you. Uh. Yeah. Mm, what do you enjoy most about doing your job? Interacting with the different people and um, being able to help certain people. Okay. Um, <clears throat> showing people how to use the internet to where it's like some of the people I interview or some of the people are homeless, right? Mm -hmm. And with them being homeless, they may not be... <laughs> completely out of there. They may not be without cell phones, without this, without that. Okay. They may have access to cash app, you know, or, or sell government cell phone, anything. Mm -hmm. So when I do that and they have a cash app and I drop these videos, that's the way I show my support for them because it allows the viewers to be able to send them whatever donations they like and, they, I, and I feel I've done my job. And it, I do it from the heart. I do everything from the heart. And uh, meeting people like you, you know what I'm saying? And who don't want to sit in front of a beautiful, sexy woman and, you know. Correction <laughs> goddess, another woman. Well, there you, there you go. Okay, so, so <laughs> what goddess? Whatever, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Whatever you want to be, that's what, you know. Who, who wouldn't want to, you know. And also, who don't want to be the cameraman to a woman, a goddess, Pouring milk, shaking, twerking, you know what I'm saying? When she get a donation. You know what I'm saying? We about saying? to break the internet like quarantine yeah. radio. And there you go. Shoot. <laughs> Free tour. Oh, but uh God. yeah. So yeah, that's it. That's, that's you know, I guess I hope I explained it well. Yeah, he did, and guess what? I'm about to simplify it for him real quick. Mm -hmm. So basically, our man just told us that he is a digital light worker. Let me break down to you what a light worker is. So a light worker is something spiritual. I found this out when I was incarcerated one time. And uh, a light worker is people that shed dark on, um, shed light on dark situations that don't get enough exposure, like uh, families that fighting CPS but that are competent. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Or, um, for instance, domestic violence, which you know it gets enough light shed on it, but I guess in the scopes and areas of practice that don't really get enough attention, that's what light working is. Yeah. Gotcha. Going and doing God's work the right way. I appreciate <laughs> that. I appreciate that. You're welcome. Yeah. Oh. Next question. All Let's right. Keep it going. Let's see. Mm -hmm. um, Android or iPhone? It depends. If I'm creating content, iPhone, and if I'm just talking to somebody, I don't even give a fuck. I can use your phone. <laughs> can I use your phone real quick? <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Let's see. Next question. Next question. Let's mm -hmm. see. It says Mario Lopez or Matt McConaughey. Hmm. Say by the bell, Mario Lopez. You was back. You was popping back in the day, but mm, you want to talk about making love to a grown woman? Matt McConaughey. Matt McConaughey. Mm -hmm. Okay. Them Lincoln commercials just do something to my skirt. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe have y'all melting, boy. Come on, Matt. Let's make a movie together. Let's do a sex scene. <laughs> <laughs> what if Matt see this? Matt see this and hit you up. Shoot, okay. Matt been slid it. Go, I will go from Z list to A list. Yeah, <laughs> slid in your DM, shit. <laughs> you can slide in my DM. <laughs> yes, indeed. Because he thinks I'm pretty. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you been, you, you, yet, you been through that shit, huh? <laughs> 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 That's what they say. <laughs> oh, man, this interview is too fun. I love this. Yeah. <laughs> so let me know when I. I'm sitting there fighting with this camera, with the camera angle. I'm trying to get a better angle. Like, okay. I should have been. 
There you go. Like, like, How do you yeah. want me? How do you want me? Oh, sh- <laughs> girl. <laughs> no, it's done. It's done that you can't finish now. I'm trying to do my job. Trying let to be let professional. Let me control this vision. You're yeah. This is yeah. of a vision. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's it. Go ahead and put the next okay. question. <laughs> it's very slow. Okay, so where do you see yourself in five years? Well, five years I see myself accomplished with seven figures in savings, seven figures in multiple different uh, checking accounts. Um, I see myself uh, owning the high rise that I'm currently working on right now. Um, fully owning it means that I pay back my investors um, during the probationary period on time without no penalties. And um, just focusing on self love and cultivating um, a piece of land, growing my own food, vegetation, raising my own livestock and cattle, um, growing my hair out, nails, and uh, being a modern day hippie and wonderlusting. All right. Okay. All right. I'm with all that. Yeah. I hope I hope it all comes true. Thank you. Yes. Yes. I wish the best uh, for you. A little insider. I'm a high priest of bloodline shop, so everything I come in my mouth comes alive. Say it again. I said I'm a bloodline shaman and a high priestess. I didn't ask for it. This was given to me. Um, okay, explain say, that for the, for, the, for the people that don't understand. Okay. Um, it's like I was born gifted and every day I'm just doing the best I can with the gift that God gave me. You know what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. I really can't put it into words. But like my dreams are visions. Days that like I haven't walked into yet. So the premonitions. I don't have a dream journal, but I have a very good um, imagination and roll the deck for memory. Um, when I touch people, I can feel their pain or being around them. I'm empathic. I absorb their emotions. Um, I transmute people's energy and I turn it into happiness and love. And uh, I heal people with earth's elements in my bare hands. So. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. That's what's up. And right. I can also hex too, so don't fuck with me. Mm. Oh, wow. <laughs>